Uh, Q, standing for Contested Urban Environment, is a five-nation uh, research uh, program. The aim of the program is to um, confront the urban environment, stress the technologies with what we call the urban stressors, like the artificial light that you find in an urban environment during the night time. So that's quite difficult for our night vision systems. You know, the different uh, what we call uh, urban canyons that you can find in uh, dense urban uh, environments uh, is very difficult on the communications and uh, the GPS. These are uh, characteristics of the, the cities that uh, we're looking for. My name is Patrick Maupin. I am the experimentation director for the contested urban environment experimentation happening in Montreal. We've got uh, in Montreal around 150 scientists and uh, technologists um, that are manning the different technologies. Uh, our main partners uh, are the NATO uh, nations, but also the TTCP or Five Eyes uh, countries, Australia, Canada of course, New Zealand, United Kingdom and uh, the US. We've got also about 100 uh, soldiers from the 3rd Battalion, Royal 22nd Regiment. So these guys are working together, uh, they get trained together, and then they go out on the streets and they test their technologies. Uh, we are testing in Montreal uh, different technologies, over 50 uh, of them. Uh, we've got the uh, protection uh, systems for uh, you know, protecting uh, areas or fencing of areas from any uh, intrusion. The uh, ground-based ISR systems, that's uh, a set of uh, sensors that are deployed on the ground, or uh, we've got uh, airborne systems. Uh, currently over Montreal, uh, as we deploy our troops and other technologies downtown, we've got two aircrafts flying over the, the area, uh, equipped with uh, quite uh, special uh, cameras. Uh, we've got a uh, soldier system with uh, sensors, uh, GPS and a tactical radio. So we've got about 24, 25 soldiers wearing those tactical vests. We're trying to find new synergies between the technologies and very often we discover, you know, uh, things that uh, we have never uh, thought about uh, before. We're discovering new capabilities. Uh, so that's that's to me that that is really the most interesting thing about this exp uh, about the experimentation.